Hyvä. What the heck? Felt like someone helped me right there. Steve Harrington? More like Steve Shreddington. What do you think, Dustin? Steve, Nancy made a huge mistake. I know she did. Jonathan's a really lucky guy, man. I help, idiot. He's a ninja, a force of nature, Good morning, everybody. Or maybe it's the evening. I have no idea where you live. We got ourselves a nice cheat day. I've been craving this for a while, and I have not had a cheat day in about two and a half weeks. Your boy needs something good in his mouth. That's a bit. Anyways, that could be interpreted different ways. What's going on everybody? Jesse James West here. Hope you're having a fantastic day. We're treating ourselves well, but of course we're doing it alone. Any girls out there, hit me up in the DMs. No big deal. If you guys are new to the channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button. Hit the like button if you're feeling generous. Your boy truly appreciate it. We just hit 82,000 subscribers. It blows my mind every single day. You guys are literally allowing me to chase my dreams and let it come to life. I'm just gonna stop talking there, say thank you, and let's go get some damn food. Come on, give me something, Miley! <laughs> Listen, guys, if you don't start your morning off with some Miley Cyrus, Taylor Swift, or Katy Perry, you're doing it wrong. We're making a really quick pit stop into a yard sale. All I see is a bunch of gym equipment, so you never know. Let's see what we find. There she is. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, so we just picked up a new tricep and bicep machine. I'll put it in the gym later, I guess. I've said this in the past. If you're not bringing a date to McDonald's, you're just missing out. I mean, take my advice. Don't take my advice. Hello, how's your morning? Good, how's your morning? I'm good, thank you. Thank you very much. Good morning, McDonald's. Thank you so much. Oh, baby. Let's go. So, people, if you're wondering who's next to me, we have a very special guest. It's a very special woman. It's my mother. <laughs> we have liquid addiction, liquid dopamine, and liquid caffeine all in one. My beautiful coffee. Oh, shit. I didn't get ketchup, son of a bitch. We got two sausage egg McGriddles. Hold the cheese, and we got two childhood hash browns because it's the best thing that ever happened to me since sliced bread. And my mom got some healthy oatmeal because she's not having herself a cheat day. She's actually normal human, so. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. If that's not heaven, I don't know what is. Don't forget this. Oh, thanks mom. If you guys aren't pulling strapped up, I don't know what you're doing. Get a little sugar-free syrup action on there. Wait, 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 give me some too. One deep in the yeah, family. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. So today, I'm just gonna eat whatever I want. The only rule is, it has to be from McDonald's. Taste test. Mmm. Mmm. There is syrup infused into this bread. I wish I had syrup infused to myself. You just can't put enough, you know? You know, it's kind of weird. I was taking this girl out on a date the other day, and then I pulled out my maple syrup, and she was like, what the hell are you doing? We're in public. And I was like, listen, I know we're at a fine wine and dine, getting a steak dinner. I'm allowed to have my sugar-free syrup. I mean, wouldn't you guys agree? Holy sh**. Let's dive in. Bite reconnected to my childhood bite. Best bite. Mmm. Wow. You see, sugar-free syrup is good for everything. You put it in your coffee, you put it on your food, you put it on your sides, you put it on your girlfriend. No big deal. 38 grams of protein, 124 carb, and 74 fat. Woo! Ooh, let the regret sink in. No big deal. At least I'm gonna keep telling myself that because that was hella good. Comment down below what your favorite thing from McDonald's is. It's gotta be the McGriddle. The McGriddle beats everything. All right, guys, we just picked up the entire prison rig. It looks like I'm gonna be working out in prison right now, like I'm outside. <laughs> a cable pull down, a cable row, and a cable curl. Now when I have friends work out in the basement with me, where we get some more collabs going, we're gonna have another thing for someone to use. The fun part about this is gonna be getting it downstairs. I have no idea how it's gonna go without it falling on me like a vending machine. Wish me luck. Just went for my morning walk. I was a little late on it today. No big deal. We're now gonna go pick up lunch. Let's just say it's going to be big. It's gonna be salty. I'm excited. Charlie, are you excited? You still speak from the Will Tennyson video, don't you? <laughs> Charlie's excited. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Shall we? <laughs> Okay, so we just picked up McDonald's. What else is new? Obviously, we're gonna eat that all day. Probably one too many items, not gonna lie to you. And they gave me a free apple pie because I had to wait, so thank you, McDonald's. McDonald's, if you're watching this, do me a favor and sponsor me. That way I can get McDonald's every single day. Aw, shit, here we go again. Item number one, fries. 
crispy chicken sandwich, apple pie, and what absolutely grew on me, a fish filet. Now I really did not ever think I would enjoy a fish filet because fish from McDonald's doesn't sound too hot. Cue the dopamine. Oh yeah, bud. Now that's satisfaction if you ask me. Wet and drippy, just how we like it. Fat Jesse is on a comeback. Oh, oh. <laughs> you have no idea how good that was. Oh my God. All right, let's dive in, baby. Oh, last bit of the buttermilk chicken sandwich. Absolute banger, 12 out of 10. Now we're gonna move on to the fish filet, some fries, and then for dessert we have the apple pie. Holy sh yeah, yeah, yeah. So much dopamine in my head. Fish filet, eight out of 10. Fries, 8.5 out of 10. Could have been extra salty, let's be real. The more salty, the better. We're now gonna move on to the apple pie and see what I gotta say. The filling of the pie is always better because when it's really like oozing out, get you thinking. <sighs> Don't put that in. You know what this reminds me? No, I shouldn't say it. Never mind. Last bite, you know the words, best bite. Okay, in hopes of getting the better dad bod for all the girls out there that want that, we just had ourselves a massive meal. Not gonna lie, I didn't look at the calories until afterwards. Slight regrets kicking in, but we're gonna continue on with this food challenge. Your boy's hungry, still. Okay, we got 61 protein, 207 carb, and 61 fat, holy. One thing to realize about these cheat days is that I only do them massively like this, like once a month. I have minor cheat meals every two weeks, but a massive cheat day is not that often, so it's really not gonna hurt your progress. If you're already lean, don't feel too bad. If you wanna have a cheat meal, go crazy once every other week and you should be fine. It's all about memories over macros. Me hanging out with the food right now, those are good memories that I'm gonna make. So I'm gonna enjoy them. You see, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I don't always take the stimulated pre-workout, but today's one of those days that if I'm going all in, I'm going all in. We're gonna be taking Transparent Lab Bulk. This pre-workout is phenomenal. It has the perfect amount of caffeine and all other ingredients. You guys can use my code JESSE at checkout for 10% off. It supports me a ton and it supports Transparent Labs. We're gonna play it slightly safe and do about 90% of a scoop. And then during my workout, I'm gonna sip on the BCA. This is a great way to stay fueled for the workout. Afterwards, I'll have Post and my greens. Whole lot of Transparent Labs going down today. Use my code. For the bulk, I'm using strawberry lemonade and it is actually refreshing. We got new merch, baby! Last bite, best bite, dopamine, caffeine. Oh, this caffeine's kicking in. Holy sh! Woo! I have so much dopamine in my head. Wow. Not gonna lie, one of my favorite shirts I own now. No! Way. These are like the thicker long sleeves, so it's perfect for fall coming up. Very subtle, Jesse James West shows your support to me and the channel. People are like, Jesse, where's your sponsorship? I got myself. Last bite, best bite, it's here! I just nailed that note. Another hoodie. Oh, I want all out, guys. I told you, I'm reinvesting all my money I earn right into the business. Last bite, best bite, tank. That's going on. Last bite, best bite. Got a nice Kelly Green, mix it up. August 15th, this will be available. So by the time you're watching this, if it's past that date, we're gonna have this up for about two weeks. So act fast. The dopamine rush has kicked in. The caffeine is fully embraced. I am beyond excited. We got lean Mace. Guys, right Mason's been dieting point. Uh, you can just see it. Look at this, look at this kid's face. I've lost about five pounds, but five pounds goes a long way. Five pounds of fat's much bigger than five pounds of muscle, so. But for now, we're gonna get into an arm workout because what better day to work out arms and keep my shirt on because I'm gonna look fat. I ate so many million calories. <laughs> then arm day and a cheat day combined. I'm gonna put the entire workout on the screen right here. In return, if you could hit the subscribe button, I don't know, I think it'd be a fair deal. We're gonna do some cable work to start. We're gonna do some cable curls and some tricep extensions. We're gonna start off with biceps first. So let's dive into exercise number one and hit this bad boy hard. Oh, thank you. Need a life for the ideas. I'm in the splash zone with the brain waves. I shoot for stars up in my aim is straight. I lay in the sand line in the palisades. I'm Alec Baldwin with the angry face. I'm Christian Bale with the black on black. Man, fuck these thoughts, I'd rather save the day. But if your man is a problem, then we can change the pace. Mom is worried, I need to change my ways. I maybe got the crib, I need the redwoods. Rake the leaves up from the money trees. Plant the seeds right in behind the scenes. I painted the dream how I live it. Well, smart and beware, they venom. I swear that I'm sick, I've got issues. I'm sick with these bars, bitch, I'm privileged. Bent off a of sips of elixir. Bank roll, need the commas and digits. My manner, I'm honest and tender. Lay low, not too much for retention. But Ben has shit popping, I mentioned. All right, guys, I'm not gonna lie. When you shorten the rest times on this, it gets really hard really, really fast. When I'm training arms, especially cables, I enjoy going. Really hard, really fast. <laughs> the rest time. 
<laughs> Listen guys, really hard and really fast is what we're chasing. Just get a crazy pump to start my workout and that's gonna be a number one tip. Always when you're trying to train a muscle and really grow it, if you're just focusing on growth, make sure you're focusing on contraction, pump, squeeze, and stretch. The next exercise we're gonna do, we're gonna start off with triceps first. We're gonna do overhead extensions by sliding up on the bench and then once you hit failure, you're gonna go up and do the negative. If you want big arms, you gotta focus on triceps. Then we're gonna dive straight into some incline curls. And when you come up, you wanna curl your pinky as high as you possibly can to the sky. That way you're fully contracting the bicep and getting the most out of the movement. We're not really worried about the weight here. We're worried about actually moving it in the right path. So let's get into it. My chest. I'll shave it off eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie, this cheat day is going wonderful. I feel amazing, I feel full as hell. We're gonna do some hammer curls, and then we're gonna do some overhead cable extensions, sticking it, sticking it, <laughs> sticking it, yeah. And I'll show you guys how to do those. They're my favorite movement for triceps. I do it a little bit different. Let's just be real, I do everything. <laughs> Second round's always the best, but the fourth round normally isn't doable, but we're gonna make it happen. Go get the stick. <laughs> <laughs> is a killer arm workout. Like I said, put it on the screen. Maybe you can hit the subscribe button. I think we all can agree that's fair. All right, guys, that is gonna be a full wrap on the arm workout. You heard the man. We need to go get some tendies. Make sure you guys follow Mason, but we're gonna go head out and get some food. You know, this is the third time I'm driving to McDonald's and I don't feel shameful whatsoever. So no chicken tendies. No, no chicken tendies. Damn. Welcome back to another episode of Jesse Gets Fat. In today's episode, Jesse's eating alone because ba da ba ba ba, I'm lonely. I mean, I'm loving it. I have sugar free maple syrup, so no big deal. We're not that lonely. We got a small fry. We got a McChicken because we're balling on a budget, guys. I'm paying for this completely on my own. So if you could hit the like button or the subscribe button, I don't know, just it, that really helps. <laughs> Let's be real. People ask why I'm making a YouTube channel. It's actually in efforts to get the girls to like me, but it hasn't been working, so we're just gonna eat really shitty. I had to chill out a little bit after the last meal because that free apple pie. Let's just say it was kind of overboard. Comment down below. Are McDonald's fries the best? No way Burger King can ever stand a chance. Their fries are absolute trash. Pour a little of that buffalo sauce right on that bad boy. If it's not creamy, I'm not putting it in my mouth. Sometimes I need to think before I speak. There she is. Let's eat these. Sandwich number one, done. Been about 30 seconds. 
All right, the moment of truth. I now have logged the calories and we're looking at 33 protein, not bad. 105 carb, not bad. 33 fat, not bad. Let's go. About a thousand calorie meal, half of my normal daily diet. I will regret this tomorrow, but I hope you enjoy it for your own entertainment. <laughs> yeah, there we go. We got a whole lot of calories in the day. Definitely way over my normal amount, but we got one more meal. It's a surprise. So stay tuned. So after my workouts, I always have my prebiotic greens and post. It's by Transparent Labs, Code Jesse. Stack them together, you get killer gains, and you make sure that you stay healthy because if you're like me and you don't sleep enough, you gotta take care of yourself in other ways. This has like wheat grass in it, which is literally one of the most amazing nutritional things. Dip your finger right in the hole. Cheers, mate. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time to embark on another purely filled dopamine and no caffeine, but a good rush. We have ourselves the one and only quarter pounder, hold the cheese. The second only quarter pounder, hold the cheese. And to top it all off, because we like being topped off, another fry. I'm not much of a beef guy, but we're gonna make this work. So before we hop into this, I wanna talk about manifestation really quick. Obviously, when it comes to building a business and it comes to all different things, like this, building a business, building a business. First of all, thank you guys for helping me build this business and, and build this community and family. If you guys are trying to do bigger things in your life and you're trying to achieve bigger things, I want you guys to be sure to write down your goals, speak them out into existence, and be confident about it. There's a difference with just thinking things will happen for you, and there's a difference with making them happen. Manifestation involves making it happen, and I promise you, if you guys start putting your mind to things and putting in that work, not only will you get two good cheeseburgers, but you might build a business. We're gonna add a little hot sauce on there because your boy needs to feel something in life. Babe, you want this? All right, cool. Wow, that is freaking good. That is some solid meat. Never felt anything but pain. All you ever did was making me darker inside. Yeah. Slowly I was starting to change. Burger one demolished. Now we're gonna make our way to burger number two. Do any of you guys remember that SpongeBob episode where he goes, no pickles. I'm starting a new segment called Food Thoughts. When I'm eating, whatever comes to my mind, I'm gonna talk about it to you guys. Today's topic was No Pickles by SpongeBob. When you guys have food thoughts, comment them down below. Last bite, best bite. A lethal amount of sodium is in my system right now. So now let's go over how I felt throughout the day. In the morning, I was pumped, I felt good. I didn't feel any of like the sodium bloat or anything. Midday, I started to feel a little bit more bloated to be honest. During the workout, I felt like I was really using all the carbs and the sodium and just being, I felt really solid and tight so I felt good. But then the post-workout meal, I feel like pushed me over the edge. And as you see, <laughs> I feel like I just ate way too much food. I guess you could say you can get away with eating McDonald's in one day and feeling pretty decent. I'm a little afraid to step on the scale because I don't want to know the number. I'm not gonna lie, it's finally Hitting me, I have destroyed my stomach, so this is not gonna end well for me. How can you make this I already know it's not gonna be good from all that sodium and all the water I'm holding. Oh. What? That's heavier than when I started my cut. I, I literally just put on seven pounds. When I did my 10,000 calorie challenge, I put on two. McDonald's. <laughs> Jeez. Let's go over the final macros as the meat sweats are finally kicking in. And in total for the entire cheat day and only eating McDonald's, we had 183 grams of protein, not bad. 543 grams of carbohydrates. This one hurts, 219 grams of fat. That is lethal, that is brutal. As you see, I'm rocking the Kelly Green Last Bite, Best Bite merch. So check it out when it drops. If you guys are interested in me covering some more business topics, I have some things in the works that I'm not gonna talk about now, but I can go over in the future. Maybe give you guys some tips on building businesses as, as I'm learning. Comment down below and let me know and hit that subscribe button. That way you do not miss out. For now, that's gonna be the end of the video and I really appreciate you guys watching this far. Thank you so much for 82.5K. Thank you all. I'll catch you in the next one. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at West. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys stay relentless and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.